Hey guys, how's it going? It's me, Richie Punk from the Puppetum Geek and MMGN.com. And today, guys, I got you the review of the Power Mat by Griffin. Now, what it is is basically a glorified scroll button. Now, saying that though, it isn't for everyone. You know, it is for a niche market because at the same time, it can complement your computer setup, but at the same time, it's not for everyone in terms of usefulness. Now, it does, when plugged in, have a nice blue LED glow at the base, but you can turn it off in the software. Now, what it does is basically you know, enable you to use hotkeys or shortcuts on your computer. And that means, you know, cutting down, um, you know, setup times or even, you know, I use it in particular for video editing and it makes it so much easier to scrub through videos and just sort of makes the process a lot faster. Now, once again, I know a lot of people who have this and just use it for even a volume button, which you can set it up to now because it does work just by scrolling. Now, you can set up for different things. So because it does work also as a clicker. So as like you see here, I press down on it and it does click and it says you can set it up to click right so click and push right you know you can change tracks click and push left it'll go to the previous track you can set up to pause and play music and all these different things like I mentioned before I have it set up for video editing and it works a treat but then again it isn't for everyone but let me move on to the build quality now the build quality of the power mat is just superb like I can't say you know it's nothing cheap it actually is a sturdy metal design now it does run you around $35 so it is quite expensive for what it is now a couple of things I would wish Griffin did with this or maybe in a certain update or in the next version because it is an old product is that they make it Bluetooth or wireless somehow because even though it is wired it will be good to sort of move it around so you can use it for different things now as I mentioned before I use it for video editing but then sometimes when I'm, you know, doing some other things, I'll love to have this a lot closer to me and have it as a volume button, you know, when actually watching movies or something like that. So I don't have to reach for the keyboard or reach for my amplifier to actually turn the volume down. Whereas this, you know, it's basically a glorified volume button. But at the same time, if you actually read my full review, which will have it down below, um, it's very useful and I can find it very useful for other people out there in the industry looking for something to cut down, you know, process time. If you're doing a lot of scrolling, you're doing a lot of, you know, cutting and clicking and all these things, the Power Mat can be something for you and it's worth checking out. Now, if you have any other questions about the Power Mat or just want to know a little bit more, you know, let me know, leave a comment down below and hopefully I can answer your question. Now, if you did like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you are new to my channel, why not subscribe? You know, I put out videos at least once a week and hopefully, guys, I'll catch you guys in the next video. See ya.